Alright guys, board briefing for Tuesday, September 14th. Our warm-up is going to be a partner game of rolling. It's going to go on for five sets. You're going to row an allotted set of meters. Anything over, you owe us a penalty of double the amount of meters on your screen in a different movement. If you're under, same penalty. Okay? And both you and your partner were served the penalty. So if you're row, if you're 10 over, you mean you, it means you owe us 20 of the movements that are prescribed. Your partner goes, you goes 20 over, you owe us 40. Well, we'll put a limit on it. But yes, let's try to hit those meters right on. Okay? Specific warm-up. Double under uh, warm-up. This is our chance to practice double unders. Okay, and we'll get more in depth and we'll give time to people practicing, right? It's not, we're not just gonna rush through and leave people behind here. Alternate, 20 seconds, alternating reverse lunge with a high knee at the end, okay? Back to the 80s aerobics workout. Rest 10 seconds, 20 seconds of single lunges. Set two, 20 seconds walking lunges, 10 seconds rest, 20 second double lunges or double under attempts. Like if you're on the cusp of getting double unders, even if you have to wind up a little bit and do a double under and then land and then reset and do another one, that's what we're talking about. Rest for 10 seconds. Set three and four is about the overhead walking lunge. Start a little bit lighter, first round. 20 seconds overhead walking lunge. We'll talk about it right now. Elbow must be straight at the top. I can't straighten my arm because I'll hit the ceiling and put my hand through the wall the ceiling but must lock out your elbow at the top of the movement, at the bottom of the movement, at all times, okay? 10 seconds rest, 20 seconds double unders, and if you're really good at double unders, practice triple unders. 10 seconds rest, grab a heavier dumbbell if you're able to keep your elbow straight, and do it all over again, okay? All right, so let's talk about the workout. We have RX version, double trouble, five rounds, 50 double unders, 50 foot overhead walking lunges, 50, 35. Level two, 30 double unders, 50 foot walking overhead lunges, 35, 20. Level one, one minute of single unders, 50 foot walking lunge, not overhead, okay? Let's just talk about intent of the workout, okay? There's three main things we're looking for. Keep the workout under 10 minutes. The other one is, on the walking overhead lunges, elbow must be locked. If it's not locked out, we're going to ask you to grab another weight, something a little lighter where you can lock that elbow out, okay? So a good time to practice here. Number three, if you struggle at double unders, this is, this is, where, this is where this workout comes into play. You struggle at double unders, I really suck at double unders, I can only do a few, great, practice, right? We'll allow a lot for one minute of double under practice through each round of your rounds, which will you get some practice under stress. If you feel like throwing your rope across the gym, gym, refrain from that and go to singles. But if you have a few double unders, practice. Even if the double, single, double, single, trip, double, trip, double, do them, okay? We want to expose you guys to some high stress while doing double unders. Right. Um, if the weight doesn't suit you, you want to go a little bit higher than that, but you're not quite at 50 or 35, you know, bump it up five pounds. There's no harm in that. This workout here, if you feel like doing some overhead walking lunges, but you don't, you're not a 20 pounder yet, grab a 10 pounder, grab a 15, try it. Okay. We're not going to, we're going to stop you from that. So just to reiterate what's going on, 10 minutes or under, more like six minutes. This is a fast and furious workout like Fran, okay? Uh, arm locked out on overhead walking lunges, one minute of double under practice every round, or a double under attempt every round. The other thing is, there's a, uh, not a finisher, but some skill work. I didn't put it on the board. It's six minutes, three, two, one, go. You're gonna do five windmills on one arm, five in the other, five overhead squats, five overhead squats, with a dumbbell or with a kettlebell, okay? This is gonna set us up nicely for later in the week. We got some Turkish get-ups going. It takes a lot of mobility, flexibility, stuff like that. These are skills that we're trying to acquire to make our life a little bit easier, okay? So let's hit this workout hard. Let's meet those requirements, the stimulus of the workout. Hit it hard, get after it.